guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a what in my toddler diaper bag video. And bear with my makeup. I don't have any eye makeup on. That's why I look so tired. And I'm and I'm actually very tired. It's like 10:39 in the evening right now, and I don't have any sleep yet. So bear with me. So first of all, I already did a what in my diaper bag back then but i believe it was like a newborn type of thing so right now my baby's one year and four months already so it's very interesting to show you guys what i keep in my bag now that he's a toddler a lot of things changed so yeah but great thing i'm still using the same diaper bag which is this kip hop diaper bag i really love this diaper bag and in my last video i reviewed um this bag and yeah you can just check that out so i don't have to be redundant or anything so i'm just gonna show you and tell you a bit of information about this bag but as you can see this is black and it's a backpack all of skip up bags has this stroller strap so it's very helpful as well but right now i don't really use it since our stroller is um a bit light so when i put something um, on the handle it falls off so yeah it looks like this and it has um, this compartment and then this second one the biggest one which is the main compartment and then two side pockets so yeah let's get started so I think let's start with the side pocket for the side pockets I have my baby's shoes and this is the Nike ones and I always have shoes with me and Yes, I have it in the bag just because when he's wearing it already, when we head out of the house, he takes it and he touches it. Of course, shoes are dirty. So yeah, I just keep it here and then wear him his shoes when we're ready to go. Sometimes I have my water bottle in here as well, but right now I don't have it. But here on the other side, I have his water bottle. So I have this um, local... Um, brand which is Bebeta and I really like this just because it's big it has a cap but I can't find it right now but yeah so here what else um I also have an echo bag in here like a bag for like when you shop because here in my area plastics are not allowed so we use paper bags when we um go grocery shopping and such so it's harder to bring so I always keep a like a bag in here but I actually used it a while ago that's why it's not here and then this um, zipper so for this zipper I have basically small stuff and this in this area in here where you can put your phone actually you can fit your phone but um, I just don't like my phone to be there I want it to be here but yeah what is in here is I have an alcohol which is the screen cross one this is 70% solution and I prefer alcohol than hand sanitizer because of the texture and sometimes hand sanitizers has those like sticky feeling and scent to it so I prefer alcohol so next is I have my handy dandy lipstick which I really love this is the water drop tint stick from Holika Holika and I love this so much I use this with everything so this is actually the only makeup product that I have in here so next would be um, q-tips for boogers and such I don't really use um, nasal bulbs just because it's not that effective on him but yeah I just use this one for his boogers and I'm not sure if that's safe but that's what it's more effective with us that's why I use it then in here I have uh, this Johnson's baby top to toe wash just because when we go out sometimes we visit family relatives and he needs to wash up and then I have this Cetaphil baby massage oil and I just have this um, before he takes a shower I put him some oil and if I need to massage him or anything like that and I really like Cetaphil products because they smell so good. 
So next is I have this ball pen which is this Faber Castell ball pen. This is only 10 pesos so it's very handy to have a ball pen in your bag. And I have tissues of course. I have another alcohol. I don't know why. But I also have this Avino Baby Soothing Relief Moisturizing Cream. And this is actually not for set because the pediatrician doesn't really allow him to put some powders or lotion because of asthma or anything like that. So I use this for myself, for my hands. Since I always use alcohol, I always need to put um, lotion to moisturize my hand because I always get um, allergy. Um, and my skin gets irritated easily when I use like um, harsh stuff like alcohol or alcohol or like soap with harsh chemicals or etc. So for short, I need to put lotion all the time. And I have my tissues and yeah, that's basically it in here. For the second pocket, which normally has the containers that it comes with, but what I put here is baby snacks <laughs> and yeah first I have this Unicare complete cleansing wipes which is this small one I don't really have a big wipes in here because I have this one which is very handy since it doesn't really take much of space so yeah I use this for everything now before I only use organic baby wipes but um, since he's a toddler now and his hands um, get sticky or he touches a lot of things um, antibacterial wipes is very nice to have and it's hard for me to bring both kind of wipes like organic wipes and this kind of wipes so I decided to just buy this kind of wipes but I think based on my observation I still prefer organic wipes over his um, skin but when it comes to hands I prefer this one since it's antibacterial and I think using this to his face um, gives him a bit of rashes and to his bum as well so I think I'm gonna go back to organic wipes for um, his face body and but for his hands I'll use this and then what I have in here is this the first year's gumdrop pacifier wipes I didn't really use this for its main purpose which is for pacifiers because Seth doesn't really like pacifiers and he doesn't really use pacifiers and but it's really nice to have for like when he drops his water when he doesn't have his um, cover I can just wipe it off and for his milk sometimes i bring bottles i'm still breastfeeding most of the time like 95 percent but um when we need to go out and i'm really busy or um he really needs to be full instantly we bring some um formula with us and then here i also have his all of his snacks which is very handy because if you can easily grab onto it so I have this baby mom mom's which is in vegetable flavor which he doesn't really like because it doesn't have the sweet kind of taste it tastes like more like bitter so yeah I have one more and then for the sweet tooth I have this Nick Nax snack for him so yeah it's really nice to have it's not the most healthy but it's really nice to have and then i have his um feeding bibs in here these plastic ones are very handy since um it catches all the food um the drops onto him he won't really get that messy and yeah and this one i have this apron as well that i use as a bib as well when he eats because these kind of bibs are like like up to his tummy only and his pants get dirty most of the time so I also use this one for the last compartment which is the main pocket um, unlike before I bring a lot of stuff but right now I don't really bring that much anymore so yeah um, inside it doesn't have a lot but it doesn't really have a few but yeah in here 
um, if you're not familiar with this one um, yet it has this con um, it has this area in here where and it has this area in here where you can um, find um, the where you can find the changing mat that this bag comes with I think every skip up bags has um, a changing mat with it so that's very nice since you don't really have to buy your own changing mat and you won't um, put your baby's butt or body on a dirty changing area so yeah I also have um, fan in here because it's very hot here in the Philippines so this is very handy and when he gets bored he loves to play with these ones and then I have this baby book in here this is his health record book so we use this when we go to the doctor so I don't really need to remove it here I just have this here all the time when we need it and then I have another fan so when he's playing with this one I still have another fan then I have the dirty pouch where I can put um, baby's dirty clothes in this bag as well it has these areas where in it has this stretchy bands here so it has two of those so what I have in here is I have his um, diaper I bring three diapers with me all the time so I have those diapers he's in size extra large of diapers and I'm using pampers right now but I don't really like it I think I'm gonna go back to Huggies I love Huggies the most the green one and yeah so next in this area I have my sunglasses which is in this Sunny's pouch and I have my Sun shades which is this one and I also have this one which is I think for from forever 21 but yeah I have two kinds um, for different outfits so I also have napkin with me just in case of course you'll never know so in this main area I have this pouch it comes with two pouch which is this mesh one and another insulated one i use this the most only because it makes his clothes very organized he keeps it in here but i need clothes i can just grab this so it's very very useful and it keeps a lot of clothes in here it can fit a lot of stuff in here and what i have in here is his bib i have two kinds of bib in here i have this um I love you bib and then this bandana bib that is first of all so it's really nice this is from happy kids and then I have this like towel whatever you call this but it's very handy for taking a bath you use it for taking a bath or wiping off something so I have two kinds two sets of clothes um, for him to change with because he gets very sweaty and again it's so hot here in the Philippines so we need a lot of clothes so I have this full on outfit next is he has this sleeveless um, top looks like this very casual very homey and very comfy of course and this shorts yeah this is from mother care so that's basically it but it's actually a lot as well but it fits in this small pouch which is really really nice i really love this one and next is this nursing cover and yeah this is very handy because i breastfeed but sometimes it's it's really not effective because he removes it because he's moving around and such so next is I have this muslin or receiving blank very very handy again you can use this with everything as a blanket um, something to lay him down on as a towel anything I really love this one and then I have two kinds of lumpin 
or burp cloths and I use this with everything. It's very handy as well. I love this. I at least bring two um, lampins with me every time. I bring um, any kind of jacket with me. Also, I also bring hat with him all the time. It's just handy to have, you know. I really love bringing hats but he doesn't really want to wear it all the time but when he wears a hat he instantly knows that we're going out so it's it brings him into a good mood so a hat is very handy for us and then this one thing we don't re really bring all the time but um, it's very handy to have we put this in a stroller because it's a rechargeable electric fan it's really hot here again as I said in the Philippines so any kind of um, material that make, can make you feel cool or refresh is very useful so we have this one I know it's pink because it's m more on the girly side to also tell you I don't bring any bag with me anymore I just bring this bag even my husband we bring this bag only every time we go out we put our stuff in here our wallet our cell phones we also put it here so yeah so this is the only bag that we bring and this is for a like a day trip only it won't really be applicable for overnight stays because it, we will of course need more stuff so yeah this is what i keep in my toddler's diaper bag i hope this video is helpful for you guys if you're wondering what can you put in your toddler's diaper bag or if you're still a new mom and you wanted to know in the future what could you bring or what would you need for your toddler i love watching this kind of videos and i love making these kind of videos so thank you guys for watching i know my eyes is super droopy i'm so tired but yeah i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up comment down below of some video requests or even just say hi let's be friends and again thank you for watching this video if you're not subscribed yet please subscribe and i'll see you in my next videos bye